So we're starting our practice test here at question one. You can see question one of 30. Now, don't be alarmed if this is not the first question you get on your practice test. I have uh, kind of behind the scenes in the settings uh, this test set up to generate uh, a random order of these 30 questions. So while you may not see this as your question one, rest assured that somewhere in the 30, is this question. So it might come up at question 15 or it might come up at question 27 or, or what have you. So um, even though this may not be your question one, it is buried somewhere in the 30 questions. So let's go ahead and dive in and see what we've got here. Question number one, we're told to select the correct choice that completes the sentence below. And we have a sentence here that says the horizontal axis is called the blank and the vertical axis is called the blank. So we've got uh, a series of drop down menus here that we have to uh, correctly choose and plug in the, the, the right choice that completes the sentence. So let's see, the horizontal axis is called the, well of course we know that's called the X axis, and the vertical axis is called the, well we know that's called the Y axis. So to quickly review here, let's see if we can quickly outline what our XY grid looks like. So we know that the XY grid here, the rectangular coordinate system, is just a series of two number lines, one number line running horizontally, that's the x-axis, and of course the one that runs vertically is called the y-axis, and we talked about in class that one kind of quick trick that you can help yourself remember which is which is by, well, let's draw the letter Y itself and we're going to elongate and really exaggerate this letter Y because when we do this we can clearly see that well what kind of line is this here in the letter Y it looks like a vertical line itself doesn't it so that's one way you can remember that the Y axis is the vertical and of course the remaining axis that we would have to label would be the horizontal X axis so there we go we have question one in the bag the horizontal axis is called the x-axis and the vertical axis is called the y-axis. And remember, I said that there are a series of questions in these 30 that you are going to see word for word. This is, hint, 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 one of those questions that you are going to see replicated word for word. So please make sure you're able to identify the x-axis and the y-axis on your grid.